guys, we're back for another Dokkan Battle video. So, we're going to hop back into the Summon Banner. Uh, we are going to go for our boy LR Vegito right here, or Goku and Vegeta. Um, I think there's a real possibility that this is the best unit in the game. Um, obviously, I'd like to, you know, get them rainbowed, you know, get all their links up to, I don't know, at least like level 5 or 6 or 7, something like that. Take them in the Super Battle Road, and then really test things out. Blue? No, okay. Uh, all right, so Super Vegito gives us a 1 in 9 chance um, of getting uh, Goku and Vegeta Angel. Um, obviously, nothing else on the banner is of any use to me except for uh, Supreme Kai, who I actually did pull in the last video, I think. Uh, I got Supreme Kai and then also who? Um, uh, oh, uh, Tech Kid Buu. I actually could use one copy of Tech Kid Buu because I realized that that's one of these units that Dokkan Awakens... Ugh. Yeah, that's not uh, not who we're looking for. Can't use him as an Elder Kai. Just worthless, really. So is that Trunks, obviously, too. Um, but uh, Tech Kid Boo, when he Dokkan Awakens, he Dokkan Awakens into Buff Boo, who... You know, Buff Boo, honestly, I think is probably, like, the second best Boo card in the game right now. Uh, he was number one, but obviously, I mean, LR Boo Tanks are Boo Haunted far better, right? Like, that's not, yeah, that's, uh, that's not even close. Um, but uh, that Tech Kid Boo, you never know. You know, he could be good for chain battle in the future stuff like that like you know i don't really keep as many versions of like the the ssrs of like you know like the str fat boo ssr and stuff like that but something like that is this the card that goresh keeps pulling over and over i think it is right now. <laughs> all right well i got him now too i think yeah i think goresh pulled him like seven times or something like that from this banner i mean that was i'm, I'm sure goresh is probably done with the summons by now but that was even before he was done like oh brutal 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 listen i've I've gone through the ringer, right? My 25 Krillins or whatever it was on the blue Goku and Vegeta banner. Uh, I'm never living that one down. That's not going to happen. <laughs> so, all right, let's see what we can get. Uh, nothing. Okay. Well, you know, we will continue on. <laughs> all right. So, um, I, I actually, I'm not even really too sure how many stones deep I am on these banners either. Because it's one of those things where... When there's the free multi, right, the, the three multis plus one free, that always does kind of leave me in a weird spot because it's like, you know, sh should you kind of count those multis as well? Like, you know, like, uh, you know, not actually stones used, but those are, there's a whole bunch of multis eventually that racks up on what would be like a lot of stones used or something like that. Um, Global, remember that Gotenks um, is going to be coming to Global within the next couple of months. I mean, it is interesting. Global is actually going to be in a Majin Buu Saga celebration, I would think, until, like, December. <laughs> I know I know that seems insane, but... Because, I mean, I imagine Blue. Okay, so we have a 1 in 4 chance. Uh, this is either in LR Vegito, Cell, Super Saiyan 4 Goku, or Goku and Vegeta Angel. Uh, I thought that was transforming a Vegeta for a second, but he's on the other banner. Okay, that's not, what, that's not the Vegito Blue animation. All right, let's see. They, this is them. Goku and Vegeta right here. Okay. That's not why we got the Vegito Blue animation. Super Saiyan 2 Goku. Uh, really good that he's on these banners, by the way. Very, very good. All right. Let's keep going. See what we get. Ah, of course. Yeah. Super Saiyan 4 Goku. I mean, you know, I, what's funny is I've never had trouble pulling this guy. The LR Super Saiyan 4s, I pulled them. Like, I rainbowed them both so easily during the 4-year anniversary. Um, and then, of course, you know, just pulling them repeatedly during New Year's as well, right before the five-year anniversary. Uh, and now here we are, right? Like, it's like, yeah, those those units um, never really struggled too much pulling them. Oh, wow. Double LR Multi. Okay. LR Int Vegito right there. That's the second copy I've pulled of them from this banner. Um, okay. So I've pulled as many copies of them as I have the Goku and Vegeta Angel card. I mean, double LR. I mean, that's a good multi. Right, like, if you're a new player or you haven't been, like, a super mega whale or something like that, like, I mean, this would be a very strong multi. I, I, all three of these cards, like the Super Saiyan 2 Goku, that Int Vegito, this Goku are all amazing. Even God Vegeta is pretty solid right there. Um, and then this guy, the, the STR Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta at the end, um, he's probably going to be getting a Dokkan Awakening. Or, or, excuse me, not a Dokkan Awakening, an EZA um, at some point. Um, I don't know when, but... Um, he is uh, a, a character that awakens from the hero and villain extermination event. Uh, and all those characters are eventually going to EZA from the EZA area. So, 
um, that is something that people can expect to actually happen, right? All right, Videl, not great on our god animation. Uh, I have pulled, like, a ridic... <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know, that's, um... I was literally just saying I've pulled him a lot. That's not... <laughs> not uncommon for me how many gokus are we at i, I have bobbled all of the non lrs i've pulled from these banners uh there's just no re like it's uh, yeah like here's the 25 copies of in super saiyan 2 goku i've pulled or something right like whatever the lrs are the big ones all right so goku lr super saiyan 4 goku let's go ahead and take a look here um here we'll go by this okay so we've pulled him six times all right that's fine uh, I don't know how many, again, I, I actually, I really don't know how many stones I am deep on these banners. Um, I did show how many red coins I had at the start. I, I imagine by now I'm over 5,000 stones on both banners, um, which is really not that bad, right? Like, I, you know, I, it, it's just Boo Tanks was just very, very easy. He was a ridiculously easy rainbow for me, which is just not something I'm really too used to. I mean, a lot of times with these dual Dokkan Fests, one of them um, I do tend to get pretty good luck with. Oh, please, God, anything but him. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> probably my most pulled unit in this game. All right, well, okay, here's the thing. We're getting... <laughs> okay. I was literally about to say we're getting a, an insane amount of featured units right now. Copy numero three. All right, so we have two more copies to go. Honestly, this is going pretty good. I mean, uh, you know, I, that's that's about it. This is going pretty solid at this point. Three in a row, Dokkan Fest exclusive featured units right there. Uh, please, uh, can we continue this? This is good luck right here. I, I'm loving this. Again, at this point, I only need two copies now, man. Like, any multi could be the final multi I have to do in this banners. Blue? Oh, okay. I don't know that, yeah, I, I, cause, okay, so, Blue Goku and Vegeta was, like, my, my second worst shaft ever, right? Like, it was just awful, awful, terrible. Um, but then, Jiren was one of my best legendary summon banners ever, right? LR Jiren. I rainbowed him in, like, what was it, like, 3,500 stones or something like that? That's a monstrous W. Absolutely insane god-level W. Um, but then Ultimate Gohan, again, was one of the best Dokkan Fest exclusives for me. Wow, another featured. Okay, sure. Um, Ultimate Gohan took me, like, 1,700, 1,800, the rainbow or something like that. Like, that's that was one of my best banners ever as well. So, that's two in a row. So, you know, when I was, like, 2,000 deep or whatever without pulling Goku and Vegeta in this banner, I was like, yeah, well, you know, this is how it goes. <laughs> you, you're not insanely lucky every banner. You're not super unlucky every banner. Eventually... It is going to even out. The luck is going to sort of uh, even out for you. Um, and, you know, uh, listen. <laughs> I, I, I guess now I, I really have to be nervous about the Legendary Summon banner um, next time. I, I, I feel like that's, that's what we're going to have to worry about. Uh, what, in like two weeks or so, we're going to get a Legendary Summon banner? I think that is going to be where I could have really, really bad luck. Um, just based on how good the luck has been in the past several banners, right? I'm also really holding out hope that we can get that Supreme Kai. Um, I do... Now, I was not able to rainbow Boo Piccolo, which sucks, because Boo Piccolo is an amazing unit. Uh, I finally got a chance to uh, do the Link Level 10 showcase of him, and he is really good. <laughs> I mean, that's... He's super good. Like, 200k defense... He's supporting... Oh, Gotenks. Hey, okay. Well, again, this guy's coming to Global soon. Uh, again, like I was saying, Global is going to be in the Boo Saga celebration until basically, like, December. Um, because, you know, all of September is the download celebration. The download celebration lasts, again, through all of September. So that's that's what you're going to expect to see um, throughout the entirety of September, um, including the Legendary Summon Banner. Then I would think that October is going to be Ultimate Gohan. Um... I don't know what else they would release in October besides Ultimate Gohan. But then November, the start of November, I think would be uh, Boo and Gotenks. That's sort of like, those are going to be the next um, couple Dokkan Fest exclusives that are going to hit Global Dokkan, right? So um, Ultimate Gohan obviously is amazing. I think the Int Gotenks is spectacular as well. 
I'm not as crazy about uh, Exchange Majin Buu. I mean, I, I'm pretty much a well-known Exchange Majin Buu hater at this point, right? I just, I don't know. Um, the unit, like, it, it's... It, Exchange Majin Buu is almost exactly... Oh, TN. Well, I mean, that's... It's just Baba at this point, but... Exchange Majin Buu is just almost exactly like EGL Zamasu released a year later. Uh, it's It sucks. Okay, so that's the third copy of this Goku and Vegeta. But again, featured units galore here. Um, no way am I about to cut this video off in a second or anything like that when we're pulling just infinite featured units. Like, every multi... Oh, we, wow, we pulled multiple Videls in this video? Okay, whatever. Sure. <laughs> Fine, fine. I, I, I guess I'll take it. I'll, I'll take it. I don't know. I'm kind of... Ooh, Whis. I One thing is I've not gotten any good animations, man. Like, I've, I've gotten... So, we've pulled, what, eight of the ten? So, you know, I need ten combined Tankses and Vegitos. Of the eight, only two had good animations. Oh, I was hoping that that would be a Whis right there. Um, And it sucks because, the, to me, that's the most exciting thing is Zeno, Goku, Black Rift, Whis. Like, those... Those are the best things for, um, like, you know, doing these summons. And I really, I feel like I don't get them that much. Like, I don't know how people uh, just get, like, these animations nonstop. You know, I open up my Twitter mentions, and it's just, like, it's just a flood of Goku Black Rifts and Zeno and Whis. And it's like, man, how do y'all do it? I, you know, like, I, I rainbow every unit, and I get, like, I get, like, one animation per rainbow, man. Like, <laughs> Because, I mean, at this rate, that's that's the the uh, the rate I'm on, right? Is um, one animation per rainbow, basically. Because, uh, you know, I, I Bootanks rainbowed. I got one animation. And now, you know, Vegito with three copies were at one animation. But, you know, we'll see. Maybe we'll get some... Maybe we'll get some more animations for him. I would like to see a Goku Black Rift. I think that's the next one I want to get. Um, that one is always a sigh of relief. Because it's like... You hit the multi-summon button, and it's like, oh, the dread sinking through. What? Oh, come on. We just pulled him. The dread just sort of seeping in, right? Like, oh, here we go. Brutal again. And then you see the blue skies, and it's just like, yes, 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 the blue skies, right? Like, but, you know, so we'll see. Uh, we'll, we'll see if we're going to, you know, get anything good like that. Um, I don't know. Do not know the answer to that. All right, come on. Let's fit. Let's let's get greedy. Let's finish out with one more Goku and Vegeta Angel. Come on, just give us one more. So then, at that point, your boy is just one copy away. I I do still plan on summoning on Copal, by the way. I think um, we'll, uh, we'll 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 do some summons for uh, for our boy uh, Goku and Vegeta Angel over there. Maybe try and get one copy of him at least. Maybe do some summons for Boot Tanks. I think I would like to, but well, then again, there is. It's a legendary summon banner coming up too, so let me not go too too crazy. But so far, only what like we're probably like six thousand stones in right here or something like that. I think. I don't know. It's it's very difficult to uh, know for sure when I'm not really keeping that close to track. Again, the red coins is the surest way for me to tell. I did spend eight hundred red coins though because I bought two copies of the Tech Fat Boo. Because uh, I did want to get full dupes for him. And, uh, again, I'm not going to be summoning on Bootanks' banner anymore. Because, um, uh, obviously, Bootanks um, rainbowed him so quick, right? All right, maybe we'll just do a few more here. Um, feels like we might be slowing down. Just a lot of unfeatured units at this point. Still would love uh, one more Kabito Kai, man. Get him rainbowed. Then I can start farming up his links and stuff like that. Because, again, I wouldn't really recommend you start farming characters' link levels until they're Dokkan Awakened. Because... Remember, they get links when they Dokkan Awaken. Like, again, Kibito Kai gains fierce battle when he Dokkan Awakens. So, obviously, you know, you know you're know, you not going to be able to level up fierce battle until he's awakened and stuff like that, right? So, um, definitely make sure to not level up uh, characters, uh, links, or anything like that before you actually get, like, the final copies of them and stuff. So, um, we shall see. Uh, yeah, featured units slowing down a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. All right, Nova. We will do one final multi right here, uh, and we'll we'll end up with uh, the free multi just left. So let's see how we do. Oh, okay. Well, if we get an LR, I will do one more after this. Um, you guys know the deal. We're not going to end on an LR, but uh, we, we the trunks carrying my that is a one in nine chance. Just give me a chance, right? 
All, all I need is a chance. Let's see what we got right here. Give me that one in nine chance right here, baby. Goku and Vegeta Angel coming right up. Not a good animation again, but I'll take it with this. Ah, oh, damn, my Super Vegito. But last time... Oh, okay. I was going to say, last time we then immediately got Goku and Vegeta, though, so... Mm, looks like it was just for the Super Vegito. And Gatope. Gatope was a good unit. Okay. But, um, honestly, I can't complain. Uh, we that's, a, that's another successful video because we did walk out of here with a Goku and Vegeta Angel. Very good. All right, two more to go, and uh, we will be done with the summons for the Dual Dokkan Festival. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you all next time.